by involving everyone. So, yes, you do need, uh, you know, a number of geeks at a at a overall level, global level or regional level, whatever your overall level is, that you know have these super creative ideas that follow these worldwide trends and can combine these trends and say, hey, well, listen, if I combine this with this, this might be an interesting idea to look at. This is one thing. But also, I think I rely a lot on people on the ground that are in mm. a day-to-day, out-of-hour contact with your single most important stakeholder, which is your client. Uh, and they see things. If they open up their eyes and are curious, why are people sitting here? Why are they having a coffee there? Why are they talking over there? What, what, what is happening actually in the software of a shopping center? And those people, if they are curious, they will see opportunities and they will see risks. They will see uh, problems that they can solve through a, an improvement, which we then call innovation, uh, or other things like um, we're now bringing together uh, small fashion entrepreneurs, new fashion designers into one concept. So we pick 30 of them. All of them could never afford to pay the rent in a mm. high end shopping mall. But if we bring them together, we sign up for a JV, we take half, they take half, and we both share in the profit, all of a sudden you have a fantastic uh, outlet in your shopping center with a lot of uh, enthusiastic entrepreneurs. Um, so you don't have to risk your whole business by just testing and trying those things. And right. if you're successful, you scale up. And if it doesn't work, too bad. We do something else.